hello welcome to tech easy good afternoon to everyone today in this video i will tell you how you can set up your child account for the family link so if you want to set up family link first of all you need to open the play store and just install this google family link and once it is installed you need to have this child mobile here as you this is the child's mobile and the one i am recording here is this is the parents and once you install google family link on your parent open this open family link app on your mobile and starting it will ask the sign in for the app you need to just uh, say okay with your gmail id then the next screen you will see is add child you need to click on the add child does your child have a google account so on the child's mobile means on the secondary mobile see here on the secondary mobile there should be an email already signed in into this particular account okay uh, this particular account if you don't have any email you can create one for your uh, child i assume you will have this account so i'm clicking on s yes. then all the other settings you need to do it on this child mobile so open your child mobile yeah. here you need to click on the phone settings phone settings first and scroll to the bottom until you will find something like google here so press on the google here and click on all services and scroll to the bottom until you will find this parental control option under children and family you will find this parental control tap on this parental controls see okay you can click on let's do this so for this particular means i assume this is the email id what you have on your child's account so supervise tech you need to tap on this so already there is one more account on my this phone the secondary phone or the child's phone so it is saying like sign out that account and continue so i'll do it if you don't have any other account along with your child's email then you won't this, uh, see the screen directly you will see the screen click on the next step here you need to enter your email id i mean the parent's email id followed by the password so that uh, all this process is going by your choice so as soon as you enter the gmail id of yours and the password uh, on this mobile means on this current mobile uh, on the parent mobile you will get a two step verification so you need to accept that first of all uh, i'll do that uh, parent email login on the child's mobile my email and the password yeah it will ask for the two step verification and see this is the next screen here what parents can see and do if you connect through this family link that parent and child uh, uh, setting to the configuration this is what you can do you can read all the points manage account settings and controls block or approve apps control location settings limit screen time on supervised devices okay all these things you can do and there are things you can't do also what parents can't see or do so you can all read the points and scroll to the bottom if you are okay with this you need to enter the password of your children's email account or this current this current mobile login email id see there is a email id mentioned here for the same email id i assume this as the child's email id and for the same you need to enter the password so i'll click i'll enter the password and click on next yeah see here when i click on next your parent must be admin for this device okay you can read this and click on the next here so allow the supervision yes this is what our primary requirement so i'm clicking on this allow here see the review settings you can reach each and every review settings the filters on the chrome means if you want to block some sites you can block it from your device actually not on the uh, children's device you can allow tech to visit all or some of the signs when signed into the chrome tech can ask the permission to visit yeah so yeah if you click on this allow only approved sites so this would be better yeah filters on the search safe search will filter out explicit results 
filter blur off so filter is default you better keep it filter okay so you can read out with the options and you can choose uh, with the appropriate option whichever is your requirement if you want to control the games and everything only rated 3 plus yeah only rated 16 okay only rated 16 plus if you keep this some of the apps will be excluded from the play store so yeah you can check with all these details okay and then you can click on next ready parental controls are ready for this phone and her account to manage the discipline from your phone download the family link app so i have already uh, completed that step so i'll get back to this my family link app so what i'll do is i'll open my family link and then click on this done here so once i click on done okay the notifications i allow see this is my child's phone means uh, till now i have shown you the secondary device here right that is the device which is here okay uh, set the amount of the time text spends on their uh, device so i can actually increase or decrease the time here and the days also sunday if you want to uncheck you can uncheck few or if you want to keep all days then so minimum uh, the screen time the overall screen time if i set to like 3 hours 45 minutes yeah manage the amount of the time to expense okay see the daily limit i have edited so this is on the children's mobile from my parents mobile mom from this primary mobile we can actually set the settings the downtime decide when text uh, look for the night okay next see the app limits for example say if there is a instagram app or a youtube app on your children's mobile so these are all the list of the apps on the child's mobile okay for example say for the youtube if you want to give the time limit you can set like 2 hours 30 minutes this for the day okay if you click on done see here 2 hours and 30 minutes if it is exceeds automatically the app gets locked okay or the app or the phone gets locked and not only that see there is a option here to lock this particular device so if i press the lock here the phone gets locked i'll show you practically how it works so i just have pressed this lock for the children's mobile so i'll open my camera i'll show you so this is the children's mobile right i'm trying to unlock this okay i'll give the password okay see time for a break your parent has locked this device parent access so if uh, the child clicks on this parent access uh, there will be your email id the parent email id will be shown and they need to enter your password that means the parent password in that way they can't be able to unlock this particular device when they can unlock so uh, here you need to enter the, to the family link app when you click on this unlink unlock so from here remotely only this uh, phone will unlock the children phone for example i'll show you see here this is already unlocked so in this way you can have the so this way you can have the control over your uh, kids mobile or the child's mobile not only that there are few more uh, content restrictions everything you need to just check each and everything and account settings then you can play with these settings if you do have any questions please do ask in the comments i'll continue in the next video as this video is getting long i hope you like this tutorial and thanks for watching have a nice day